You can create a lookup feature like this using a simple dget function. Before you roast me with why not use vlookup and xlookup, well, you can use those functions too, which I will make another video about it. For now, this is how you can use dget function. Let's first of all create a lookup table for the UID or a pull down menu here. Put your cursor at A2, go to data, then under data tools, click on data validation. You'll have this pop up window. Make sure you are on a setting tab. On the pull down here, you're going to select list. On the source, click on this and highlight all the UID on your, on your database table or your table itself. Once that's done, click OK and then you will have a pull down menu like this. So the next thing we're going to do is to use a dget function here. Say equal dget, open parenthesis. The first argument is your database field. Make sure you put the header as well and go all the way down to the very last row of your database table and then press F4 once to make it into a fixed reference, comma, and you're going to select this B4 here, or rather the name model itself is the field name, as you can see here. And the third argument on your dget function is the criteria. You're going to select the UID, including the header itself, and press F4 to make it fixed. And close parenthesis and hit enter. You can see that you have that value here. And if you change this UID itself, like this, you can see that the model changes. Now all you have to do is control C on this B2 cell and paste it right across like this. And you can see the lookup changes accordingly. Now if you change the UUID to whatever you want, you can see all the values change accordingly.